was buying it. So we kind of ended the band. Case in point, this was the sales report from 2007 for Moe's Haven. And we were looking, and in an entire year, our top, our top grossing song had earned us $5.77. That's not a lot of money. Second place was earning us four fifty three. But I noticed a trend. You know, you know that college try song that was so good? That didn't earn that did not make the top two hundred songs in earnings. You know that song Dig In, which was emotionally wonderful and great? Way down at the bottom of sales leaders. But look what was number one. We wrote a silly song called Shut Up Your Monkey. It's about a loud monkey. And it earned us five dollars and seventy seven cents. Most people would just quit. But a little light bulb went off in my head, and I was like, you know what? People go on iTunes, and they type in the word monkey. And the only song that comes up, or one of very few besides Monkey by George Michael, is Shut Up Your Monkey. And so I decided I should write more songs like that. And I know what you're all wondering. You're wondering, what does Shut Up Your Monkey sound like, Matt? Well, guess what? I'm going to play it for you right now. And don't be afraid to sing along, too. Three. 